We have seen relations between the United States and Saudi Arabia reaching a low point. Of course, Saudi Arabia and the US have a disagreement over this latest OPEC Plus production cut. How would you describe the tone of the relationship right now? Well, look, the relationship between the North American people and the Saudi people has always been very close. It's never been uh, a problem any time. Uh, so many tens of thousands of Saudis have gone to school in the U.S., hundreds of thousands. And the, the issues seem to be more personalities than anything. And frankly, I don't think that had any effect on the relationships. Uh, businesses as usual uh, were producing and selling uh, our resources and the world is buying them. I, I hear a lot in the media, but I, frankly, I don't sense any tensions myself. So walk me through this latest decision by OPEC Plus to cut production. The White House has accused Saudi Arabia of siding with Russia. They say that decision means that Saudi Arabia is helping to fund the Kremlin's war machine. Of course, that's an allegation that Saudi Arabia firmly denies. But if that is the case, why cut production now? Well, look, production is running at, uh, at 11 currently. Uh, the cut is in November and it goes down to 10.5 million. That's a lot of oil. The markets are already down. The EIA was showing a two plus million barrel uh, drop in demand. Uh, the long term outlook uh, futures markets are all showing a very soft market. And uh, everybody's talking about a recession and uh, a loss of demand for energy, uh, oil in particular. So this is a smart business thing to do. And they're going to review it. They'll review it in December. If uh, there's a need for more oil, I'm sure they'll add more. If there isn't, they'll probably take out some. So it's a straight, pragmatic, practical business decision. Uh, I don't know why such a big deal has been made of it. And you know, this is the way business runs. You, you respond to demand. Let's talk about those recession fears. We've heard from Jamie Dimon here, David Solomon. These are titans of Wall Street saying a recession is coming. What do you think that's going to mean for the oil market? Well, I like what, what Mr. Dimon said because he put it into the proper context. He said this is a geopolitical, geoeconomic, geotechnical issue. It's a much, much bigger issue than the recession. And, and those decisions that created those kind of problems have nothing to do with oil. They have nothing to do with our own production. Uh, we will respond to the markets. Uh, I think uh, His Highness, the Minister of Petroleum, uh, Saudi Minister of Petroleum, uh, is very, very uh, careful about what he does and how he does it. Uh, he monitors everything very closely uh, and he's very pragmatic. Uh, the politics, it's not part of the oil business. It's a completely different issue. Uh, the Europeans have to sort out their problems. Uh, the Europeans seem to be going into wars all the time. It's, uh, it's something that we can't fix for them.